Alright, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. We're back with more Assassin's Creed Valhalla Steppy Steppy action again. <laughs> if you enjoyed the series so far and you want to see more, don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. I mean, it's free and I'd appreciate it. And Bird Buddy would appreciate it. <laughs> Let's get back into the shit again. Okay, whatever the last video was, we were doing the Son of Yorvik mission chain with, uh... What's his name? Halfdan Ragnarsson, I think. And we were all the way up here. I just went back to Ravensthorpe uh, for some upgrades and to sell some shit. But yeah, we're gonna fast travel to here and then head over to my first objective. All right, first objective we got here is meet Faravid at the Wolds. I don't know what the Wolds are, but we'll probably find out. This looks like the place. Is that Faravid? It sure damn is. Welcome. Join me in drink. You made it. Come, have a drink. You're a few horns deep already. <laughs> Yet still floating. Tell me, how did my old friend like his goblet gift? There were other things on his mind. Your man Ulfra, for instance. He died protecting the spoils he stole from Hafton. Ulfra. Poor Ulfur. I told him to mind your tongue, but he wags it like a slobbering dog. Was Hafton always so easily riled? No. Riches and glory have shaped him into something new. He's not the same man he used to be. What is this place? I expected an army ready for Warcraft. This was our first camp in Northumbria. I came here with Hafton and his brothers, Uba and Ivar. We besieged Jorvik and put King Alla in the cold ground. Those were good days, now too far gone. What is all this? My share of the treasure we took from those distant days. I buried it here for a rainy day. This bag is heavy with silver. Enough to pay for an army. Come! Race me to Jorvik, Eivor. Remind me of the glories long gone. You're too drunk to win a race. Then have a drink. Make it fair. <laughs> what? He challenged me to a drunk race? A drunken race? Alright, just give me a few little handfuls. Don't mind me. Wait, are we drunk? I, I think we're in a drunk state. No, 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 no! I need my fucking wolf to turn around. God damn it, he gets the lead. My wolf goes faster than this peasant horse. See you in horse? This is a wolf. Majestic wolf. Faster, Eivor. Ride like Sleipner's hoops. Your horse is slow, and her... <laughs> Your horse is slow. I don't even know if I'm going on the right path. Or if there is a path. I'm just kinda going whichever way looks right. Oh, let's go down here. Where is that dude? He's back there somewhere. Ah, oh, shit. Can't go over there. Oh, no. Fly, my Fly. Shit, we have to go to the Show bridge. Where's the bridge? It's like right here. Dude, Faravid's in the dust. He ain't catching me. Having trouble keeping up. My horse must be deeper in the cups than I am. 
What are we doing in Yorwick? You haven't said. Paying a visit to our kept King Rishiek. Long may he reign. I haven't enough men to beat the Picts alone, but with Rishie and his fury, we'll finish them off. You'd bring a puppet king into this fight, but not your Yol? Shh! Keep this to yourself. The streets have ears, the windows have eyes. I did not agree to this level of deception. You should have told me this before. Well, I already told half time, so it doesn't really matter. If I describe my full strategy, we might never leave the campfire. I prefer the light of a fire to the darkness of your plans. Don't do it again. Move, bitches. Hey, get out the way. Where the hell's Resiege yet? Dude, can I chop on his horse? Oh, I can't. That's kind of bullshit, dude. There you are, wolf buddy. Let me on ya. Because I'll get to where we're going before he does. Oh, maybe not. And a ye? We're here. Wait. A favor I must ask of you. Make no mention that Halfdan is ignorant of our plans. It's better this way. Are you mad? Rishia answers to Halfdan. You put this man in grave danger if he defies his master's will. Rishia cannot defy orders he has never heard, no? Trust me. I will take the blame should our plan fall apart. It already has fallen apart. I told Halfdan about your plan in like the last episode, I think. Eivor the wolf kissed and half done's cupbearer. What a curious surprise. I hope the day finds you and Jorvik well. Yes, we scrape by, with what little we still own. But this new war should make us wealthy once again, until our tribute is taken. I smell the bile on your breath, king. Do not forget who is in charge here. Oh, do remind me, Faravid. Yesterday it was half done. But today, I hear whispers that you are leading the charge. I am confused. Yes, you answer to Hafton. And now, he orders one final strike on the picked stronghold at Magnus. To make war with the North on such a scale will require a hefty amount of silver and a large force of men. My soldiers and silver are pledged already. I expect the same from you. I have given my aid as well. The battle must be decisive. I see. And you have these orders from half done in writing, yes? From the great man himself? Half done knows or half done doesn't know? Shit. I don't even know, bro. I mean, we did tell Halfdan. Ah, oh, fuck it. Not with us, but you can rest assured Halfdan has need of you. He expects a swift victory. I'm sorry, Faravid, but duty compels me to refuse. Without strict orders from Halfdan, I will not risk the lives of so many. You deny me? I do. To gift you an army puts my wealth and reputation at risk. That's not what Halfdan wants. He needs a strong and loyal king. You presume to know what Hafton wants. Hearsay is not enough. For all I know, this is another of Hafton's tests.
greatest snake in Northumbria that Saxon is. We need his army to take Magnus. And we'll have it. If we falsify orders from Hafton ourselves. You would do this? Draw up fake orders and pass them off as real? That's it. And I know just who to speak with. Hjor of Jorvik. He'll know what we need. Good. Hjor's favorite alehouse is nearby. Seek him there. Oh shit, boy. Come on, you wolf. Let's go. Where the fuck is Hjor at? Let's see you. My dude's over there. Let me guess, is that him? I'll Looks like him. More than bread. Things were better under Arden. You're just where I hoped you would be. Eivor, gods, you have come at just the right moment. Right then, watch this. Go home or get hurt. But you won't bother my friends. I'll bother who I please after I brick your face to the brains. Okay, no need for that, bro. Oh my lord. Give me old drop kick. Yeet. <laughs> Why does that eat all their health? That's so stupid. Yeet. Get drop kicked, fool. Eh, eh. Adding insult to injury. And a drop kick. And one more. Thank you, Wolfkist. Those men will wake up soon enough. With greater sense, I hope. What brings you back to Jorvik? Secret errands for Hafton. I need an army of men to face the Picts in the north. Has Hafton planned an attack he cannot afford? That's not like him. To be clear, Faravit made this plan, not Hafton. Does Hafton know of this plan, or...? He doesn't. But he's given me leave to act as I must, for reasons I cannot share. Yes, we've heard the rumors, and all our messages have gone unanswered. Can you aid me with some trickery? Help me forge a set of orders from Hafton himself. Force Rishia's cooperation. You will be taking quite a risk. You have my thanks. We can meet outside the Royal Hall, after you have the documents. I can drink it all, Damn, we're bringing them into a trickery? A drink. a drink, you say? Don't mind if I do. You both seem to have settled well in the city. Yes, we do enjoy the comforts we have here. But I still think about Norway. The cold and the warmth. Stay on the road safe, Eivor. I try Wait, to... that's all? <laughs> okay, then. Okay, I guess it's back to the Royal Hall now. Here, there you are. You got my fake documents. Here, take this forgery and pray that King Rhysia sees nothing amiss. I trust you know what you're doing. Straight from Hafton's hand, as you see. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Well, if Hafton's loyal mules are managed to fight, still, my help will come at a price. If you're speaking of coin, I remind you that your soldiers are mine. Hafton's, my good man. 
Hafton soldiers for these are Hafton's orders. Correct? But I jest. I jest. All is in order, then. If Hafton commands, I shall raise my feared. And you shall have your fighting army. Good. Get them marching at once. This must happen soon. As soon as they are mustered, Lord Faravid, and no sooner. Eivor, a moment with you? I'll meet you at Stenweir. Faravid is Hafton's man. So are the Hemmings of Nottinghamshire. As are we here in Jorvik. But not you. I don't like talk that dances around thorns. <laughs> For whom are you fighting, truly? Uh, we'll go to the middle. I fight for myself and my people. As any great leader must. Why ask me of loyalty? What are you seeking? An innocuous question. Loyalty is a word that slides off the lips like honey. Sweet to the taste, but never lingering. There are things simmering in Northumbria, hidden from even you. Take heed and have a care. There's some sketchy shit going on here, brother. Next quest, 845 meters. Uh, meet Faravid and Stenway. Where the fuck is that? It's up here. Shit. No close fast travels. Whoa. So this is Stenway. We raided the fuck out of this place before. They didn't even stand a fucking chancy. What? Who the fuck is you? Why did you attack me for? Better luck next time, lad. Okay, Faravid's up here. Ooh, out of tungsten ingot for that. Nice. Where are the Saxons? We need them to take that fortress. Patience. Rishie promised an army. What about Hjord and Lufmina? Luvina is ahead with a dozen of Yorick's swords. Come. Our Saxon allies have reached Magnus. We should march. Ooh, it's time for battle, motherfuckers! Yeet. We have to travel another thousand meters? What? Okay then, we're off. Is this the place up here we're taking, or is this our camp? Hmm. Alright, this is our camp. Cool. What'd you say to me, you little shit? Yeet. What's up, Lufina? On the battlefield once more, old friend. Yes, my arm. As in days of old. Who are you to speak of the old days? The days when my word was bond. The days when the light of my glory lit the world. How dare you speak of those days as if they meant anything to a traitor like you? Who told you of this? My new ally is more loyal than my old friend. Eivor Two-Faced. That is your name. 
Gently, friend. I told Halfton because it was my duty. Enough bickering, all of you. We are at the edge of war. Preserve your rage for the enemy. Yuvina talks sense. We fight this battle and we end this war. At this moment, nothing else matters. Look there. The pigs send a message. Raven Taylor, with me. You will talk them into a surrender with your sword sharp tongue. Talking them into a surrender? Bro, I want axes to fly, dude. I don't want no peaceful fucking war battle. I want blood! I want battles. Big battles. But if we must talk first, so be it. What's the objective? Negotiate with the picked envoy? Envoy? Alright, he's up here. Hello there. Turn tail and run, back beyond the wall. The Romans built that wall to keep us out. But they are gone, and we remain. Someday you too will disappear. Wall or no wall, we have more gods than you. We may have but one god hidden, but we have many more friends. Who now is the rightful king of Northumbria? Oh, you motherfucker. He's a traitor. <laughs> oh my god. I knew that guy was a little sketchy. You want some? Hey, you look like you like some axes. Hey. So Ricier is a traitor. Who would have thought? Well, he is a Saxon living with a bunch of Vikings. It was kind of inevitable that he'd get tired of our Viking shit. Thank you very much, Lufina. I need Stammy. Yeet. Man, this dude's putting up a fight. Jesus. Thank you. Alright, let's get all up in here. Reach the inner compound, extend the ladders. Why are we all standing around like a bunch of headless fucking chickens? Whoa, brother. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Should probably do what the game tells me to do this time and extend the ladders. There we go. Now everyone can climb up. Because apparently they couldn't. And I could just jump up there the first time I did it. Holy shit, these arrows are melting my health. Ooh, one yeet! There you go, friend. Take care of these fellows. Let's get up here. Uh, reach the intercom pan, reach the gates, destroy the gate reinforcement bar. Oh, do we have to climb over? Might have to climb over and destroy the bar behind it. Whoa! We need to get down from here. Need to let the boys in. Yes, open up.
get in here, boys. Need all the help we can get. Reach the Palisades. Oh, shit. Don't want to mess with that. God damn it, I hate when they do that. Fuck you! You know what's worse than one spear guy? Two spear guys! Stomp me! Is this broken? Now it's broken. Hey, fuck you! Oil, oil, no, 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 no. We've learned how devastating oil can be in past raids. And yeet. Nice. No more oil for you, bitch. Now we can push through. He had no health, that's pretty good. You're dead as hell. Yeet! Catch that bitch! Wait, how did half time already get her out over here? Wait, where's my next objective? Shoot links to the blow of the drawbridge. Climb up for God's sake, Sable. Let's climb up here. Boy, that's fucking Faravid. Don't know what I'm stabbing him for. That's one. Hey, don't do that. And that's two. Let's cure the inner courtyard. Come on, lads. And assassination yeet. CJ is going to get one hell of a bad death for betraying half done. Hey, catch this. Yeet. Oh, now he's dead. <laughs> Chop! I'm going on a fucking street, boys. You're all getting chopped up. Oh, we only have to secure the courtyard. What, what are you doing all the way over here? Are they all dead? Cool. Sweet taste of victory! Mauricia defeated. Was he the thorn at my back? The traitor I suspected all this time? Save your praise, Hafton. Mauricia may yet live. That coward will be dead in a snowdrift somewhere. It matters not. This day is not done until we've seen his corpse. Do not relent. Not yet. Eivor, rise like an eagle or call like a crow.
Wait, there's more of them? Huh. Won't make a difference. They're still all gonna die. Wait, they're raiding us this time? I haven't been on this side of a raid yet. That's pretty neat. Boy, catch this. You. No, how are they climbing our fucking walls? Jesus, they're already climbing over here, dude. Come on, boys, start shooting those fucking arrows. Jesus, why am I stuck on a goddamn ledge, man? It's so bullshit. Alright, let's fucking climb back up. Okay, they haven't breached our wall yet. That's good. I need to get rid of all these fucking archers. Jesus, there's still heaps of them. I would jump over this wall, but I feel like I'd probably die instantly. We'll just take some pot shots at them. Oh no, they breached. Are they glitched on there? Maybe. Oh no, they're coming up. You want some? Come get some! And one yeet! Dead as hell. Let's jump off here. Dead! He's not dead, he's fucking decapitated. He doesn't even exist. Let's get that dirty dog. Oh, I can shoot him with one arrow. Oh, he's lucky I have no arrows. Looks like it's gonna be a foot chase. CJ, come here, you little shit. Don't make me run. Come on, Eivor, go a little bit faster, my guy. Okay, fuck this dude. How far are you gonna run? Why can't I catch you? Come on! Speed, Eivor! Dude, I'm never gonna catch him like this. Dude, you I can't even call my wolf. This day, oh, nice. Dead! Please help me back to Jorvik. Let my heart expire at home. I have no favors left to offer you, Rishia. Soon, you will walk beside your guard. But I... I see no light. I feel no warmth. Only... an icy darkness. A, a cave. Hell's frozen door welcoming you. What, what waits for me there, Eivor? 
what waits for me. A traitor's death for a treasonous fool. He was the hero in tales he told himself. A Saxon who loved his homeland. You cannot begrudge him that. There is something in that. No more Saxon kings, Eivor. I am through playing the puppeteer. The fate of this shire rests on my shoulders alone. You'll take the crown yourself, and the extra burden it brings. I will. But I will not rule alone. My friends, my allies, will keep me standing upright. Let us talk of our alliance in Jorvik. Leave this king to his winter kingdom. Well, shit. No one's giving him a burial. Yep. He's gonna be eternally cold. Oh, I was gonna... <laughs> I was gonna carry him and eat him off the cliff, but it's like not even a fucking high cliff at all. Alrighty, what did Halfdan say? Meet him in Jorvik. Um, cool. Let's go do that. Back in the good old Royal Hall once again. I think we might be talking to Halfdan in here, I possibly. Let me start when Halfdan is present. Oh, it's Halfdan's coronation. Cool. Moira, is Halfdan about? Eivor, welcome. Halfdan has stepped outside with Faravid. They shouldn't be far. He stepped outside with Faravid. That's kind of sketch. Is this a Jones Viking? Huh. Cool. Where the hell's Faravid? Are they up there? Oh yeah, this is them. I struggled to be surprised. I was caught off guard. But I should not have been. The ceremony hastens to start. Let's not keep the crowd waiting. Eivor! Yes, let us go. To inscribe our names in history. No more pulling strings. This throne and its burdens are mine. If you make it to the throne, maybe Faravid's a little salty, you know? You accused him of fucking treason. Maybe he wants to be king. Who knows? Hopefully we end up being, like, I don't know, one of Halfdan's new allies, and a friend, that'd be nice. <laughs> I wonder if his dog is gonna be like his fucking side king. Have you had enough fun? My crowning must come soon! I'll save some for later. Let's make a king of you. To Eivor and the Raven Clan of Mercia, our newest ally in blood and glory! Thank you, Halftan. That's good to know. To Halftan King, I lift my horn and raise my brow to speak this praise. Crown Spire. Stout Oak of Valkyries, Spinner of Battle Wisdom, long may you live and rule. Skull! Skull! <laughs> Did I not call that? The wine, dude. It's the wine. All that Moira, shit's poisoned. What is this metal? It's soft, like Roman pipes. Ah, oh, that's lead. A toxic metal. And was it lead that drove the Romans mad? Can metal do this to a man? Oh, God in heaven, yes. The Romans knew this well. And my poor mother, she... She drank from cups like these for so long. She... Was he a traitor? Holy shit. 
All these years you gifted me poison. <laughs> you gifted me madness. Old friend, please. Your sickness has clouded your judgment. This sickness was no accident. I trusted you. Sheath your weapon, Farid. Eivor, make this man see sense. He's old, sick, and his mind is unclear. Oh, shit! You want me dead, you lying shit hog? I was a fool to not see it! Dude, it kind of makes sense, though. The thing about Moira's mother and Led? If it happened to her... It can happen to him. I don't think Halfdan's crazy though. Oh, I don't know, man. Oh, we'll go with the second one. Treason must never go unpunished. After all we did together, after all we won, if any of my clan committed such a betrayal, I would rip his flesh from his bones. Ah, oh, shit. I hope I was right, Theravid. I don't know, I might be killing a fucking innocent man. Again. <laughs> yeah, I don't really have a good track record. Hey, hey, fuck you. He's good with it, though. Jesus, am I gonna have to pull out my... S <laughs> the Shimitar? Or the Skimitar? Whatever that sword's called. Fuck, he's so goddamn fast. Why aren't you fighting him half time? Why do I have to do this? Jesus. He is beaming me. I need to get him away. At least that'll help us get him some damage. Dude, he dodges all of them. Dude, oh man, I hope he was a traitor. I did this in the start of the game with Soma's clan. I killed the wrong guy, well I accused the wrong guy. He should be dead in like a few more hits. Yep. Treasonous bastard! Stand and fight me! Old friend, do you remember the days we raced our horses across the length of this land? You were always faster. You always won. Because I let you win, my Jarl. So I will let you win one last time. We will meet once more in the corpse hall. Dude, don't tell me I was wrong. Oh no, I'm sorry, Faravid. Oh shit, dude. Yep, he's dead. finish this game I'm looking up all the right and wrong choices because I feel like that could have been a wrong choice it's well not the preferred choice hmm? I'm leaving for Mercia going home and go with this a sign of friendship a bond between our clans a symbol of the pain and suffering it took to win the I 
hope we were right about him. Me too, Eivor. I hope we were right. Alright, I'll assume that's a wrap on this arc. Yep, year of the Shire are completed. The sayings of Halfdan. Once again, back to Ranvi and Ravensthorpe.